Hi everyone, so this will be the review for the new TRN MT1. This is a single dynamic driver earphone. It is their most affordable earphone that I, oh sorry, it could be their most affordable, but at least to my knowledge, I think this should be their most affordable earphone that they've made. And uh, this is a big thank you to C5 audio store uh from aliexpress uh the name of the store is c5 c5 uh audio uh, that's our earphone store so they sent this out to me for review and uh, a big thank you to them which is fantastic for providing me with this review unit the thing here is that the the earphone comes in the standard kz box i don't need to bring that box here it is not necessary um the cable it came with i don't care about that cable i had to change that cable right up uh, the bat um so technically the cable on here is an eight core it's an eight core black uh uh cable I, I like this cable it really blends well with the clear version that was sent to me so this is an eight core high higher quality cable that has a microphone on it uh, because i wanted a, 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 the ability to still make calls with it and not be uh impeded you know, honestly i needed to be able to make calls uh, with this as well so that's why i got the 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 high quality eight core cable that had microphone on it now uh going on and judging by the specs that you would get normally with this uh, unit uh you normally would get it to be able to work with your smartphone uh the specs is very forgiven uh the it, 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 you don't need a lot of power to to run this it, it works well off my lg v v40 lg g7 the the, the the power is just fine if you want a little bit more get an amp i have paired it up with an nx1 uh, 4c amp different budget amps it works very well with amp it, it actually responds well to amping as well if you need to but it's not necessary uh to be honest it, it, at, at this price range it's not just all you need to do is to upgrade the cable and upgrade the ear tips the ear tips that are on this is the uh, the ear tips that came with the Wheezy audio, uh, the Wheezy Carlin earphone, the HEO one. So I like their vocal ear tips. This is the vocal one that I put in here, and it works very well with it. It's a fantastic ear tip, and everything is nice uh, to the to 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 others uh, on the, for the most part for this particular unit. Now let's go on to sound. And for sound um this is a wonderfully tuned earphone i love it um honestly this is to me uh one of the best budget earphones that has been made till date um so let's go on with the sound it has a very um kind of like it's not v-shaped but a little bit u-shaped in its tuning where it emphasizes a little bit of bass but not in the blonde-esque uh kbr ks1 likes uh, impact it has a very textured uh quick bass that is not boomy but it's there but it's not too heavy but you can tell that it's a little bit elevated but not uh in the uh in that uh pounding manner that you would get from a blonde or a new kbks one type of earphone now in terms of um, in terms of mid-range the mid-range is slightly recessed but it's not uh crazy recessed it is still um uh, it's it's still okay the, the mid-range is not uh recessed to the point where you can hear vocals the vocals are very clear but what the mid-range does better than the KS1 from KVA is that it has a better natural timbre to it as well as uh, a much more coherent presentation without 
sounding harsh like there is no upper means harshness to it like that place that accentuates sibilance uh it's not present here even my sibilance track that i tracks that i i normally try to use to check for sibilance uh tracks like um uh the, the, the tracks from um uh there the, the are tracks that i use uh, like if i want to check for siblings i use um, artists like kaiser uh she she has a very high pitched voice uh especially her new album the uh, crave her her kind of like voice is a bit peachy um so it's um if you need a very good earphone to to respond very well to her kind of music overall without uh, making it a little bit harsh uh, to you now I use Kaiser most of the time her album to check for sibilance or harshness but there is another track that I use mostly to check for sibilance or harshness and it's from a DJ more or less called Nightmare uh his name is spelled n g h t uh m r e um the name of the song is cash cow uh, that song the intro of the song because he features a rapper called Gunner. the intro of that song has a bit of um uh i would say a little bit of uh an upper treble uh, harshness because of the the way he made the song so if you have a very sibilant earphone you will hear that sibilance the harshness it will be present there but with this set it is not there at all uh, it's you can hear it but it's not it's not putting it in its in your face to show you that there is uh any form of um, um that harshness and um it's very enjoyable to listen to this for a long time the only thing that uh at times i miss to be honest especially for movies is the bass frequency uh, uh that it lacks it's not bad but uh, you can tell that the impact is not uh there like i would want want it to so um i would have wanted more impact but it's not there uh i love it for what it does because the bass is much more textured it's not bloaty it is not boomy so i like it uh, but you know for movies you need a little bit more slam now where it shines very well is in sound stage the sound stage is a lot wider than the kbks one and and far better than the uh the kz edx so the stage the stage is a lot better uh for me uh in my opinion so i like the sound stage especially with this ear tip it's a bit wider than uh, normal like, i really like it so in terms of resolution it's not the best but it is very good now honestly i i like the resolution on this over the ks1 from kbr as well as the edx so for me the resolution is better uh i like it a lot better uh there are other things that i do like about it uh like playing a enrique iglesias enrique iglesias by lando this really sounds wonderful because of its spaciousness and its ability to uh place instruments a little bit uh better apart from each other so i really like it uh for the way it presents uh, music overall it's a wonderfully uh tuned cheap dynamic driver earphone and going forward it will be my daily driver just for calls i, I really like it for calls and for listening to youtube and podcast it's a wonderfully tuned iem i don't have any uh, issues whatsoever so i could use it for calls and it's it works just fine uh, not just for calls but i use it for youtube and it's it's good enough for for my just my casual listening but i i may not use it over more expensive sets for critical listening even from critical movie watching and all that 
uh, you may prefer a more expensive set over red but it's good enough for the most part so i will leave the link to the sci-fi uh, audio store the, the, the earphone audio store on aliexpress if you want to buy this product please do buy it from their store i will leave their store link in the description uh support the store they are very good they are very nice they um honestly they, they, they are they just they're just a wonderful store that i think they made me happy with the way they reached out uh to me uh they made things quite stress-free just sending this over without uh, much uh headaches that other companies do give when you want to get in products so i will leave the link in the description if you want to use that and buy from their store i know other sellers sell, sell it on aliexpress but uh they, they reached out so just buy it from their store over the other stores uh so that is it do subscribe to our channel uh, do like our content, do follow social media, and we'll see you guys next time.